This week on Recoil TV Mail Call, we're talking all about Pinty Optics. Now, what you see in front of me are a bunch of unlabeled boxes from China, so it feels a little bit like Christmas, at least if your family shops on Amazon. I'm gonna open up this one, and then we can get a good idea of the level that we're looking at. So, to start out with, we've all seen it. We've seen it in video games, we've seen it in real life, and you've seen it on gun show tables. Uh, this one you know, has a selectable optic, red and green, we all know. This has uh, been named about 15 times different things. We always call it a Barska, maybe because it was just the first one we ran into. Uh, next up, we have a standard kind of red dot. We, we can tell who we're going after, but on the side here it says Pinty, really, really big. And in this one, with no label on it, we have definitely not a Trigicon ACOG, but looks like one if you're more than five yards away. And oh, we have a gift bag. And initially, giving it a look, I thought it was going to be an EOTech clone. And in fact, we have reached a new level. This is a Sightmark clone. And, you know, here's a Sightmark right next to it. Those of you in the know already know this. Those of you not, you'll be in the know here shortly. These are not going to war optics. There are some fantastic optics that come out of China, especially the last five years. We've seen a tremendous increase in quality level, but to an optic, they don't one-to-one -one ape another one. But that doesn't mean these optics are useless. If you're in a training class using simunitions, man, I have had some very expensive glass broken in training with sims. You want a sim gun, an airsoft gun, a kid's nerf gun, a 22 trainer. Those are all perfectly acceptable places for inexpensive red dot sites or clones. And why is it a better place? Because you're not going to rely on this to save your life. It is a minor inconvenience when you break one of these at the range. In the real world, that's why we spend a bunch of money on our optics if we're literally going to war with them. Look, I'm gonna level with you. We cannot and will not advocate or endorse using any of these optics on a gun that you're going to save your own life with or a life of a loved one with. But if you're looking for something to put on like a simunition gun, an airsoft gun, a secondary rifle, or a trainer, Pinty Optics.